Look at this video. Jane had always dreamed of becoming a renowned chef. Growing up in a small town, she spent countless hours in her grandmother's kitchen, learning family recipes. After high school, she... It's called whiteboard animation and this kind of video is very engaging, attracting viewers' attention. If you can create whiteboard animation with a demanding niche, you can succeed quickly. And the most important part? Now everyone can do it with Canva. Today, I will share the full whiteboard animation workflow with Canva. So, without further ado, let's dive in. This is David and you are watching AI Lockup. First of all, select a topic or niche. For example, I want to make a storytelling video. But you can create any kind of video, like storytelling, motivation, explainer, business advisory, and others. Okay, after selecting the topic, write the script. If you don't have the script, you can take the help of ChatGPT to write the script. For my video, I generated this story with ChatGPT. After generating the script, we have to create a voiceover. You can record your own voice or generate a voice with any text-to-speech generator AI. I have generated my voiceover with 11 labs. Alright, our script and voiceover are ready. Now let's move forward to the actual whiteboard animation creation. First of all, log in to your Canva account. If you are new to Canva, then create an account and enjoy 30-day free Canva Pro trial. After logging in, create the canvas as per your need. I will go with 916 ratio. After creating a new canvas or design, come to the Apps tab from here. Now search for Magic Media. This is the Magic Media interface. Here you will find three options, image, graphics, and video. We have to generate graphics. So, I am selecting graphics. Now we have a enter the prompt on this box. According to the story, our first scene needs to generate a story about a lady called Jane who wants to be a chef. So, we have to create an image of a lady. Now if you are not good at prompts, then I am going to share another trick to generate the prompts. Come to the text box and type. I want to make a video with this story in whiteboard animation style. Can you please suggest the scenes? Please make as many scenes as possible. And here it is, you can see that, ChatGPT generates the scene description according to the story. Our story has one protagonist Jane and we have to create a consistent character image prompt. To do that, copy the scene description and then paste it into a doc file. After that, come back to ChatGPT again. Click on Explore GPT from here. This is the GPT store. Now search for consistent character in this search box and then select this consistent character GP fast and high quality from here. After selecting the custom GPT, if you have a ChatGPT Plus account, you can generate an image from here. Don't worry at this moment, you don't need a Plus account. Because we will only generate the prompt. I am pasting a ready prompt. You will find the prompt on the Discord server prompt guide channel. Just copy the prompt and paste it into ChatGPT. Okay, now we need to describe our character's gender. According to my story, we have a young female character. So, I am typing female. Next, according to the story, I am entering the name of the lady, Jane. Alright, now we have to write about some details about Jane. So, I am typing, 25 years old, dark brown hair, blue eyes. And here it is, our character description prompt is ready. Now we will generate all the scene prompts with this character. Simply copy the first scene description in the prompt box and hit the enter button. And this is our first scene prompt. Now copy the prompt and paste it into the Canva image prompt box. Now we have to select the image style. Here you will find several styles. You can select between doodle, sketch, or hand drawing styles. I will go with hand drawing style. After selecting the style, hit the generate button. Canva will generate four images for you. If you are not satisfied with the result, you can regenerate the images. Once you find the best one, click on it and insert it into the canvas. Adjust the position of the image. Now you may notice that the image has no background. So, we need to generate a background. According to the story we need a small town home background. So, I am typing small town home background. After generating the images, insert the best one and adjust the positions. Now I will change the background color. Now you can add extra elements from the Elements Graphics tab to make it more captivating. Once the first scene is done, create the new scene. Now in the same method, generate the second scene character prompt with ChatGPT, generate the background, add elements, and finish the second scene. In this method create all the scenes. 
Continue with this process until you have completed all of the scenes for the video. Then export all pages as PNG files. Now create a new video file with the same dimensions as before and import all of the PNG files, creating a new page for each one. Import the voiceover audio file and place it at the bottom of the timeline. Then change the duration of each page so it aligns with the scenes like so. Now move the selector to the end of each scene. Go back 2 seconds, then right click and select split scene. You'll see why we do this later. Open the app section. After coming to the app section, search for Speed Painter and select the app. This app comes with two settings, duration of the sketch and duration of the color fill. I find it most effective to set a shorter sketch duration so the viewer gets an idea of what the image is straight away. Select the first image in the timeline, then set your timings, making sure they equate to roughly the same length as the image duration. When you are ready, select Generate. Enlarge the video so it covers the entirety of the canvas, then place a dissolved transition between the video and image pages. Let's review the first scene. Jane had always dreamed of becoming a renowned chef. Growing up in a... Nice! Before we start on the next scene, let's place a slight transition between the next pages, so it appears like we are moving to a new whiteboard. You can alternate the direction of this transition throughout the video. Repeat this process for the rest of the scenes in the video. Now let's open the audio panel and find some suitable music. Enter suitable music for your video. Reduce the volume of the music track, then it's time to preview the final video. Jane had always dreamed of becoming a renowned chef. Growing up in a small town. Okay, after everything is set, hit the share button and then select download. Download the video as MP4. Alright, our video is saved on our device. Let's have a look. Jane had always dreamed of becoming a renowned chef. Growing up in a small town, she spent countless hours in her grandmother's kitchen, learning family recipes. After high school, she moved to the city and enrolled in a prestigious culinary school. Despite financial hardships and long hours, Jane's determination never wavered. She worked part-time jobs to pay her tuition, often staying up late to perfect her dishes. Her big break came when she entered a national cooking competition and won. Her unique fusion of traditional and modern... I think it's a quite good whiteboard animation video. So, in this method, you can also create a whiteboard animation video with Canva. Alright friends, I will wrap up our video now. Before that, I would love to hear about your experience of creating a whiteboard animation with Canva. Share your thoughts and results in the comments section below. Don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful and subscribe to our channel for more amazing tutorials like this one. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, happy creating!